If you want to provide access to discovery experience resources for your students, other than when you are logged in and sharing them with a whole group, you'll find that many of the assets inside of Discovery are available for download. And once you download them, you can then re-upload them to a location that is password protected, something like Google Classroom. So to do the downloading is extremely easy. You just find the resource that you want to use and you know obviously preview it and know what it is so I have this video on the water cycle and if I come over here to these three dots that when I rest my mouse on them say more the last choice is download I click download I can choose between a low and high quality file of course the file size and the speed at which they would stream if students are accessing these from um, online would vary so you can decide which to use. I'm going to go ahead and download the low quality and that will open the dialog box for you know where do I want to download this. Here's the name of the video and I'm going to go ahead and keep it in my downloads and click on save and that starts the downloading process which you can see right here. And once it's finished downloading often on your browser you can go right from here to see where the file is and here it is if I click on it to open it it will show up in my regular movie uh, viewing app it's no longer in discovery streaming it's now offline and you can see that the low quality isn't terrible. You may think every drop of rain falling from the sky or each glass of water you drink probably good enough for most purposes and so now I have this file available that I can then upload to that other password protected site so my students can use this resource uh, as many times as needed uh, without me being logged into my discovery account.